look at him. Put that and game I'm like, time. fuck you, you can't talk to me like that. <laughs> and then he fucking fires me. And I'm like, whatever, find somebody else to play you goddamn poets. I'm sick of it. I quit. <laughs> Yeah, I guess I showed him. I'm just not cut out for the corporate environment. You know what I mean? Okay, Edna. I'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Did you record your stupid wrestling over my Jerry Springer again? You're a mindless piece of shit. You forgot again, didn't you? You don't think of anybody but yourself, do you? Are you listening to me? You're not. Did you hear anything I fucking said? Hello? Can you even find the kids? You lost them again, didn't you? Just take out the trash. Well, apparently you didn't. You'd have to take out the whole fucking trailer. Your truck parts. Get them off the fucking kitchen table. No yeah, wonder your truck doesn't run. It's a piece of shit anyway. I just can't believe you. You're a fat slob. <laughs> you don't fucking work. You sit around here in your dirty, stained underwear all day long, drinking cheap beer, smoking cigarettes. You're just a pig. You're lousy in bed. You suck, okay? I'm over it. There's pizza boxes here older than you are. You're a pig. And did you feed the dog? No, he's probably out in the yard humping your cat again. See what you taught him? He'll never forget that. Can we turn the TV off? For two minutes? Just turn the fucking TV off! Where the fuck do you think you're going? Get in your fucking piece of shit truck and drive around Commerce City again? What the fuck? Please! No, I can't wait for you to get the fuck out of here anyway! Going out, please bring back some beer, and I don't want that watered down fucking cat shit that you drink. Bring me some goddamn real beer. I want some Heineken, okay? Got it? Can you remember it?
can hold your sausage hostage.
Buffy Show. Remember that job we had where you were the crazy blindfold and I got to smile at all the customers? You would get uptight when you smiled and people would laugh and they said you need to shave your mustache! Well, I got a recommendation from Cutie Brown Eyes, you know, from around the way, and she said bald is booty full. Yeah, but the postman Richard Cranium is bald and he... Oh, well, never mind that. You had that hair transplant from a... Hey, No, from a... No, you know, right? <laughs> No, from a goose. Flip it through the booty, hop a shake and booty, don't stop. Flip it around and hit it from the top. Slapping it down now, just like a jello. Then I sit back and I watch it mellow, cause I'm sliding in all up, up to my ceiling. And then I sit back and I get the love of you. Sing it to my booty, shake it, sing it to my booty Quick, I get off the booty at the time Booty hit the booty, I'm a don't let the booty stop I swing it to the booty, rock the slip, slap, slap that rope in your big butt, huh? Come on everybody, jump to the booty in your ear That's a move when you're real all around the room You and that big old booty are too Come on all you girls, you know what you got, what it takes To make that booty shake Well I'm like a big booty, like a thick flame And you know, I'll take you out to see a movie, but I'd rather take you home But you're all dressed up, looking all fine I like your face, and like your breasts, but I love your big behind I love your chest, but the booty is the best. Shake your booty like a paradise, let's follow in
fucking warning about those shows, man. I'll be, I'll, you know, make sure that I'm not going to be at the Ogden on those nights and at Soapy Smith either, because you guys suck. Damn. Shit, man. If, you know, if Corn took a shit and the Deftones ate it and threw it up, that would be you guys, because that's how bad you guys suck. Damn. You guys need more than a new drummer. You need a drum machine or some shit. Fuck. Don't quit your day job. Hey, it's me. The only thing I can think of. Mm, 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 I'm Discovery Channel, you turn it on and see some fucking dancers with the bells on their ankles and shit. So if you guys make a video of that, you gotta start off with like some fucking Discovery Channel shit in the beginning. <laughs> Ew, you know what the fuck I'm talking about. You know what? It's fucking break my fucking heart. You know what? I'm hurting so bad to be fucked that cup. I ain't no choice to fuck her up. If you wanna talk to me, you can call me on my cell phone. You know the motherfucking number. This song is hurting my out right now. Received August 3rd at 7.17 p.m. Cocksuckers, cocksuckers, cocksuckers. You guys fucking suck a lot of cock. Um, listen up, man. This is some shit that I fucking, like, hey, come up with. Like, when I seen you guys talk about disappointment, Jesus fucking Christ, it, it almost seems like, you know, Jonathan Davis stuck his ass up against the window took a fucking big ass shit and then Chino Moreno from the Death Tones, see he came up and then he wrote blister in the shit with his fucking left finger. And then what he did is he flicked it onto the guy from Limp Biscuit, who then wiped it onto the guy from fucking Rage Against the Machine and then fucking gave it to you guys. And then you guys are shitty. You guys suck ass. Oh my god. Next time I fucking see you guys, dude, I'm <laughs> Just stop acting like you're fucking rock stars. It's just Denver, Jesus Christ. If you're big in Denver, you ain't a fucking rock star. You're just fucking shit. Come on now, baby. Fucking straighten up. Shit. Hey, Joe, it's me, man. Um, David, it's late at night, and uh, we just had to deal with the cops because he got sick and psycho again and tried to fuck me over, but he lost. Um, I don't know, dude. Like a, I love you, man. I call you for support sometimes. Party on with your bad self. I love you. I will see you fucking tomorrow. Peace out, late. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, I'm sort of kind of by, I think. Um, uh, bye. You need to call me. I don't think you get your fucking hose back, fucking fat ass, piece of shit, pig looking girlfriend getting kicked out of the fucking cricket. Now I'm gonna beat her ass. End of message. I feel it's sorry to call you so late, but I cannot sleep, so this is when my day is going to begin. You need to call me as soon as you get home, not a day later, so we can go down and get a divorce. I feel I've been very generous. I feel I've been very kind. I got you into a house that you would never, ever be able to get into without me. And I feel I've been very patient. I didn't get a phone call from you before you left like I was supposed to. Well, my patience has run out, Philip. Another thing is, I am not appreciating getting my mail scribbled on, not at this address. 
I haven't been receiving a lot of my mail and I'm figuring out this is probably why. So from now on, you will page me. Let me know I have mail. I will come and pick it up. Capiche? I will be out of town this weekend. I leave Friday. I am not home until Sunday. I'm going to the Tyson fight with Prince Charming, who, by the way, thought my brand new Forerunner wasn't good enough for my pretty little ass. So now I'm driving around in the 600 SL Mercedes Benz. Ask your mother about it. I did go by your mother's house because I couldn't get a hold of you. She said that you guys were on tour. Tell me, Phil, did you guys have a tour bus? <laughs> Anyway, you need to call me, like I said, as soon as possible. I'm going to give you until Tuesday to call me. It is Wednesday today. If I don't hear from you, Phil, by Tuesday, I will go out and hire the best divorce lawyers in town. Hell, I might even pull them in from out of town. And I will take back everything I gave you. Everything. You know what that means. Don't think I can't do this. Money buys a lot of power. I don't want to do this, but I feel like you're pushing me, and I am not appreciating this. This could be done in a very amicable fashion. We could go down, get a $150 divorce. You take what you have, I take what I have, period, and a problem. Like I said, I'm giving you until Tuesday. Please do not bother me this weekend in Vegas on my pager. I don't want to have to deal with this then, but you can call me before I leave when I get home. But like I said, if I don't hear from you by Tuesday, the big boys come out. Okay, capiche? Comprende? I hope so. So let's get this taken care of. Okay, have a good day. Bye. One more thing, if you do call when I'm in Vegas, I won't return the phone call. So, like I said, it's no use trying to get a hold of me then. Um, let's get this taken care of. Ciao. You know you guys ain't selling nothing. You guys know no one comes to your shows, so why are you trying to play like someone does? Why are you trying to act like people come to your shows? <laughs> no one comes to your whack-ass concerts. They're fucking whack. That guitar player needs to stop ripping off Slash and start ripping off maybe, you know, someone new, like at least Metallica or, you know, not that they're good or nothing, but shit. Get some lessons or watch MTV or some shit. You guys just sound like a glorified glam band. That's all. All you guys are missing is, like, the singer of Skid Row or something. Shit. Damn, your keyboard player sucks. Like, the last time I saw you guys, you had long hair, and so that other guy, you know. And I'm like, dude, these guys are rocking. Hi, Joe, it's Crystal. Um, pretty fucked up last night, huh? Uh, rude to speak and uh, tell me how fucked up I am, huh? Like, if that was who I was talking to last night, you tell that little fucking slut that I'll be down to the cricket at six. So, uh, tell her to, uh, she better fucking watch her ass when she goes down there. Tell her to come on down, though. Come on down with yourself and air good heaven and all those people, okay? Because I ain't even fucking around anymore. Okay, you done fucked up. Bye bye. I'm just going to tell you I'm on my way over, you fucking asshole. You know, but you need fucking symbols to lead it in there. Just add that on the track. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy! What? Did you get the drums down in my headphones for? I think so. Are you guys doing the new one, Joe, Damn or what are you doing? Yeah, they're doing the drums. So I guess I can write the lyrics. Yeah, should be a good time. Write the lyrics. I've had to write the lyrics to like four songs in the studio, dude. Woo! Uh, kicks ass. Well, okay, drums are done for the day, huh? <laughs> yeah. It's okay, after nine so passes, you, you got it. Yeah. Ten. Dude, shush! That's yeah, confidential information. Six six I did this Flavor whole album cubes. in one take. Ten passes after songs. <laughs> Oh, a couple more hours. Go take a nap, Philo. Do us a fucking favor. Woo! You jackass. You fucking jerk off. Where your shit, that ain't where you my guys got the at. fucking easy job. Oh, fuck this CD release party. I hear Kirby's really good with Pro Tools. <laughs> oh, shit. Kirby's got really good with Pro Tools. Yeah, Kirby's got really good with Pro Tools. Oh, shit. Jeremy, without you, this record would be without you. So, anyway. <laughs> <laughs>